Mark Lucas for EndStuffMusic.com. Today, <clears throat> we have a new guitar from Michael Kelly Guitars, of which uh, Endstuff Music has recently become an authorized dealer. This is called the 1965 model, and this is in an aged cherry burst finish. A uh, very nice quilted maple top. It's a two-piece top. Um, I'm going to go through the features with you. The radius on the neck is a compound radius. It goes from 10 inches to 16 inches inches, jumbo frets. The back of the guitar is swamp ash, and you'll notice that it's a two-piece body, which is a nice addition. There's an open cavity here, so it's easier to adjust uh, your tremolo instead of having to take this whole thing off. And also, according to um, Kelly Guitars, it sort of simulates playing a guitar that has no um, cover on it. It's a little bit more open sounding. A little cut here. Grover locking tuners. This is sort of like a medium C-shaped neck. It's done very nicely. And we have Michael Kelly's own two-point tremolo with stainless steel saddles. A perloid pickguard and rock-filled pickups. So, <clears throat> now this guitar also has some other tricks up its sleeve. And... Uh, I'm going to try and go through all of this because this is a little bit on the on the complicated side. If we're in the bridge pickup, all right, so here is the bridge pickup, just straight bridge pickup all the way. If you pull this up, it splits the humbucker into single coil, okay? When you use this switch in the bridge pickup, what this does, here's our regular humbucking bridge, and add this, that adds the neck pickup. So that's a pretty nice sound. When you go to the fourth position with this switch back, all three pickups are on. It's a sort of almost natural sort uh, kind of compression. Um, in this position, that's both of these pickups. In this position, once again, it's both of these pickups. And then here we have just the neck. When we go back to putting this toggle switch up, what it does is that it changes the relationship where it becomes pretty much like a normal um, five-way switch. So here's our neck, neck and bridge, just the, uh, just the middle pickup, and then this is the middle pickup and the humbucker, and then back here is just the straight humbucker. So I think once you get used to, um, you know, how these things work. It, it, it's a pretty interesting idea uh, what they've come up with. Um, it's almost as if there isn't a sound that you couldn't get out of this, out of a, you know, a, a Stratocaster type of guitar. Um, I'd like to comment also on the workmanship of the instrument uh, in relation to its price point. Um, this is a very, very nicely made instrument. Um, and usually, with a guitar in this price point, you hardly ever see a two-piece center joint body. It just usually just doesn't happen. It's either three or four pieces. So kudos to Michael Kelly for, um, for you know for keeping the quality up on on this instrument. And the finish work and the fret work is very very nice. Um, 
I don't really see anything that sticks out that is, uh, you know, uh, suspect or anything like that. They did a very, very good job of putting this this instrument together, and um, and it plays really nicely too. So um, let me think here. It takes pedals pretty nicely. Here's our um, MXR carbon copy analog delay to give you an idea. Go to the next position. Third position. To the fourth position. And the bridge pickup. Split. At the beginning of the video, um, I was using the bridge pickup split with a neck pickup. I just thought that was a very nice combination of a warm sound and, and a little bit of bite on the top end without too, too much bite. So, um, yes, a very, very nice guitar. Uh, we have a number of Michael Kelly guitars in stock, so uh, you could just call us, log on to endstuffmusic.com, and... Um, my name is Mark Lucas. Thanks for coming to see us today, and uh, we shall talk to you soon. Thank you.